Right, but what the, the lesson is to understand is I want, if I go anywhere, any back, I lost. I have to think from here, my elbows go straight. Now watch. If I'm here holding, he's pushing, right? My elbow's in the center. I could be here, I could be here, here, it doesn't matter. But if he's pushing, and lock, watch. My hand goes closed, don't, you keep pushing. Come on, you're strong. Push no. it. <laughs> okay. okay, see, so watch. I've missed it. So, he, so, he, he, so here, okay, so I start here. Strong, right? Yeah. Now watch. Keep pushing. See my, I, I'm weak. My energy's here. I need to make sure my energy's here. Like this, see? Everything's here, but my elbow is in my center. Here. If my elbow's out, I'm already weak, right? I'm gonna keep my elbow out. So even when I come up to here, like this, drop my weight. Here, see, so when I do my reference point drills, I practice, I'm here, not here. See, my elbow's out. So I, might, I drop my elbow here. Now, let's say I'm using Tansa or Buji, right? You push, but if my fingers, even my fingers are open, watch. I'm weak. Fingers are closed, strong. Keep pushing. See how you feel it, right? So you, everything's important when you're learning Wing Chun. Keeping their, your, your fingers, this is no good, right? Your energy's here, energy's here. Energy's directed to your opponent. Does everyone understand that? Yeah. Okay, so the other thing is understanding hip line. So if I'm doing Ung Moon, let's say, right? And I start off and I go, Tan Sao Da, Tan Sao Da. There's my opponent, right? So it's like I'm here, I'm punching here, this is no good, right? Because my energy's there, here's my opponent. So I only move where this hip is still here. You see, because I'm forming a triangle right here. It's very strong, they push in, see? Now watch, I'm gonna turn, I'm gonna turn a little more, now push, it's weak, right? Collapses. So this hip line here tells me when I move in my form, like say, you feel the punch and I do tongue. It's here, right? I don't go here because now it's weak. I only go to here because that's my hip line. Okay? Does everyone understand that? Yeah. Sure. Okay, because before I start teaching you the Mok Chong, if you don't understand that, then it's gonna be sloppy. It won't work. Okay? So here's how I teach. Ron taught me this set like in 90 five or something, 1995, a long time ago, right? But I like these, even though they're more advanced, they're, they're in our curriculum that's for more advanced, I like it because everything that we pull together, if you're training on Mars, all the series, the, the Jiao Sao series, right? So the Jiao Sao, right? The Buji series, everything we use in that dummy set, right? Mm -hmm. So the first thing we're gonna do is you already know Pakta, right? Everyone knows Pakta, you've been doing it for the last whole day. So if he throws a, a, a cross at you, punch right faster, right? Now watch, don't do it like this. That's Kali, right? My elbow's not in the center. I wanna go here, my elbow's in the center, my BOG's here. So I go, Loi Wong Pak, Loi inside, BOG, right? I go, Loi Wong Pak, BOG, he punches the other side, Loi Wong Pak Buji, then I'll punch you. Loi Wong Pak, Loi Wong Pak, okay? But I'm checking for your Buji to see the elbow. See, your elbow's out, keep the elbow in, see how much stronger it is, right? So when I do my Wong Pak, look, see how I come here? My elbow's in the center, here, not like this. Again, see, that's not the Buji. Buji, my elbow is here, right here. Okay, so you'll get with your partner, you'll go like this. One, two, then I feed you. One, two, he feeds me. One, two, okay? Partner up. Two.